Ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment we've all been waiting for. It is race day, and it is triple world champion Sebastian Vettel against the rest as he clocks the fastest time in last night's qualifying session. You are at the 2013 Formula One Singtel Singapore Grand Prix. I get goosebumps listening to you saying all these amazing things about this amazing track. Hello, everybody, and a very warm welcome to the 87,509 people joining us at the circuit park today and a special thanks to the 262,527 ticket holders of course at the 2013 Formula One Singtel Singapore Grand Prix it is time very soon Max you gotta be pumped it is race day I'm pumped I see the grandstands filling up Singapore make some noise hey, hey. This is such a tough track. They are so nervous. One of the toughest tracks of the entire race calendar, yeah? 61 laps. You know, there's so many unique uh, aspects about this track. Of course, it's the only pure night race in the world. This is the sixth year that Formula One has been visiting this uh, beautiful island city. What are your predictions right now? Well, I mean, we all know Red Bull is extremely fast. They've showed so much race pace in the Friday practice sessions as well. So, I mean, they're the ones to beat. But then, don't forget, Ferrari has shown good race pace. So, I predict that Alonso will make it on the podium. That will be great for all the Tifosi fans here in Singapore, but you never know. We got Romain Grosjean. He's uh, known to create some chaos sometimes in the first corner. So who knows what happens into that first corner? We will see. Singapore Fibra here at the Marina Bay Street Circuit. Before you get to see all of these F1 cars and hear all of these great concerts, you're going to come through this. Gate one, and this year we have something brand new, and that's this massive tri-span behind me. Let's go check it out. Another cool feature of the F1 Village is tattoos. You can get your very own tattoo, but you gotta be a real tough guy. You know, it's too painful for me. So a lot of fun things to do here at the F1 Village. I'm gonna have a great weekend. If you're a little bit looking this back, I mean, how amazing is this? The sun is setting over Singapore. That means on this Sunday, the lights come on here at the Marina Bay Street Circuit. An overall luminosity of more than four times in every sports stadium. Isn't that it's crazy? It's pretty amazing. I mean, they spend a lot of money and a lot of precision. This is all made in France. And of course, every year it gets updated a little bit just to make sure that the drivers have clarity. And by the way, you must be all so, so excited, but we've only got about, what, an hour to go? Yeah, an hour to lights out, Woo! exactly an hour to the 2013 Formula One Singtel Singapore Grand Prix. But let me tell you, it's going to be an interesting race. For one, of course, those concrete barriers are unforgiving. Yeah. Any little mistake and you're out of the race. And then we have two DRS zones this year. Right here behind us at the pit straight is going to be the first DRS zone. And then, of course, Raffles Boulevard. And I think because of that second DRS zone, we're going to see a lot more overtaking right before turn seven for all of you F1 newbies out there. DRS is the drag reduction system. By the push of a button, Button, the race car driver will get to open up a flap in the rear wing and increase his speed. So, you know, they're going to see a lot of overtaking, hopefully. In case you haven't noticed, we do have a Formula One fan right here who is Max Long. It's been an absolute crazy weekend. Thank you, Nikki. Thank you, everyone behind the scenes. What a race.